When the vice chairman and CEO of Taipei 101, Wei Yingzhou, was forced from his post on October 28th, it was because of the unethical practices of his Dingxin group. It was no surprise then that Taipei 101 chairwoman and acting CEO Christina Song said Thursday she hopes the company's new CEO will be of good moral character. Taipei 101's chairwoman made her first public appearance since management control of the skyscraper was taken away from the Dingxing Group. In a place like this, I have to be responsible for everything. It's a very heavy burden. I hope the new CEO will be young, have management experience, and of course I hope the person will be of high moral character. The edible oil scandal surrounding the Dingxing Group embarrassed Taipei 101's management and some are wondering if it will find the sponsors needed to hold its annual New Year's Eve fireworks extravaganza. Regardless of whether we can find sponsors or not, the fireworks show will be held as normal. I can also guarantee you that this year's show will be really, really amazing. Re-emphasizing the importance of integrity, Song said the main objective in managing Taipei 101 in the future would not be sales because it is now readily apparent what happens to companies focused solely on profits.